Hey everybody, it's uh, Viking360 here. Uh, gonna run you through the uh, USB update feature of the controller. Actually, uh, I got an Xbox here. Let's run through the, the mode select. Right now I've got it flashed with the uh, COD5 Sleeper 4 mode. So uh, you're not gonna see any, um, no trigger. I haven't put any push, added any push buttons. That's a real piece of cake if you guys want to add them. Uh, I thought we'd just start out selling the quote unquote sleeper with no uh, buttons. You'll do mode select using the sync. There will be a uh, hole here for the USB. Anyway, um, mode one, mode two. Mode 3, Mode 4, and uh, back to off. Uh, to uh, gotta power it off here, I just removed the batteries to do that. Uh, to do the uh, to do an update, if you want to put a different preset in, you just get your F. Sorry about the quality of this video. This flashing key here. It's got a polarity marker. Take a look there, line it up and uh, push it right in. And uh, take a standard uh, mini USB cable that's included with the kit. Put that right in there. And then the next thing you're going to do, you want to hold down the SIG button while pushing in this X. And you're going to hear the uh, familiar Windows ding ding, and it's going to detect uh, it's going to detect your controller. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and switch over to a screen capture program and uh, and show you the uh, this the bootloader software, the software we use to program the chip. Hey everybody, picking up where we left off. Uh, I'm going to here's the uh, here's the bootloader software. I'm going to unplug the controller here so you see where we start. Okay, so you'll launch the software. Uh, once again, once we run through that uh, process with the sync button and powering up the controller, it's gonna uh, it's gonna recognize the device. Just go to open hex file, pick the mode you want. Uh, we've just got two modes now here. We're beta testing the rest of the modes. Should have those up on the website here by Monday. Uh, program. Wait for the uh, success message. Reset the device. That's it. Unplug the USB cable and uh, go play. It doesn't get any easier than that. Um, else, not much else to say. Uh, you can swap out presets uh, between games. Uh, you don't have to. Uh, you don't have to run a preset now. You know, for ten different games, you can get a preset uh, with your favorite features just for the game you want to play today. Uh, if you're sick of COD5 and you want to play whatever comes out next month, uh, we'll we'll be putting out presets for all the popular games, and uh, you'll just uh, throw away your old game disc, uh, go out and buy the new game disc, and uh, reflash your controller. That's it. Uh, anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, you'll hear more from us in the future.